Hello, welcome back to Castle Smashes, the full smash of Dino Crisis on the Dreamcast, the Sega Dreamcast. Now, where I left off last time, I was in this room here, which looks like some sort of caution when operating the power supply pipe. By activating the main motor, you can supply power to the big elevator in case you accidentally lower the wrong pipe while trying to supply the power. Return the pipe to the original position by pressing the button on the same computer terminal. Oi, okay, too much information. So yeah, this is the puzzle room. So I think I got my generator over there. Can't look at anything here. So there's a bunch of buttons on here. Now I might have a quick look at my items. I don't think I've been getting any kind of um yeah, it doesn't look like it. I haven't been actually recording any um, uh, supplies. All right, so like notes and stuff that I pick up, <clears throat> the character hasn't been recording. So, oi, what do I do? All right, let's just see what happens. A little green button there. All right, what if I press the red button? What if I press the blue button? Nothing. Okay. So we got a green. Oh, okay, so there's two sides here. So green, let me just try hitting green on here. Which lines that up. Uh, Alright, so that's going to tell me the exact same thing. Yeah, I get it, I get it. I get it. Uh, <clears throat> Alright, so I've got that pipe going across, but how do I actually activate that? Is there anything else around here? Anything else I can interact with? Uh, Alright, let's... Alright, so if I hit green, it goes back up. So, something has to go through these pipes. Oh, I didn't want to do that. It's not green to green. <clears throat> So now my next question is, oh, okay, that curves around a little bit. I doubt I can, okay, so the only way to reset it is to do it on the, on the same terminal. Yeah, I don't really know where I need to go. So red, red. Okay, that doesn't link up. Let's see if a blue links up. Actually, I might. Tr Let's try one of these terminals. Blue. Uh, okay. Let's see if that same thing drops down if I do blue on this terminal. Okay, so it's it's the exact same thing. Ooh, ooh, okay. O okay, here we go. Alright. O okay, I see what I see what's going on here. So can I see what I've got there? Alright, let's let's reset. Let's reset everything. Probably going to be uh, stuck on this one for a little while. Uh, so this one's no, that one's not green. This one up here is green. All right, let's let's try doing some sort of elimination process. I think I need to line up all the pipes to go into all the holes. So. Green goes into green, but let me let me just see if I can bring any of these down. Alright, so that sits over there. So what does the blue one do? Alright, they all stay in position. <clears throat> so 
Green is the lowest. Yep. And then red. No. Or is blue? Or do I need to do red on here? No. Oh, okay, that, that did go down. So maybe I've got red in the wrong position there. Ugh, okay, so I need to remove the blue. No, but that that sits in okay. I wish I could just have a, like a look up button to see where I'm looking. Uh, ooh, ooh, do, do, do. So blue. What have I done here? All right, so red needs to be over on the on the left. So. Let's reset this again. <coughs> Alright, so let's lift green up. This is going to be a very exhilarating episode of just me putting pipes up and down. <laughs> uh, Alright, so I've taken, you now I can take off green here. And red. Let me see what happens if I put red down here. Alright, so that links up with that. That's good. That's good. Green can go there, but I think I need to put down the blue on the other side first. So, let's put down blue here. Uh, ooh. Can I put down the green now? No, that's getting in the way. Green first and then blue. <clears throat> One thing that frustrates me with games is puzzles. Puzzles, puzzles, puzzles. Blue now. Uh, no, that won't work. Uh, no, wait, what am I doing here? Let's pretend it's blue to see where I am. So I need green to go straight over, but will blue go over to that one? <clears throat> okay, let's put green down. Green down in the middle. Alright. Now let's put this blue down. Now is this even going to go in the hole? Oh, nothing happened. Alright, so it's this one, this side. Oh, okay, yep, yep. Aha, puzzle solved. <laughs> I was a bit worried before starting this recording that I wouldn't actually be able to do this, or I'd be spending half the episode just trying to figure it out. Alright, so I've got the generator working. Now, let's just quickly check my weapon. Got handgun. How much shotgun ammo do I have? Um, I've got a little bit, but I think I'm going to stick with the handgun for now. So now that that generator's running, let's see if I can do anything different here. Are there any doors? So go out there. Might be able to get to. To that room directly across where both the uh, pterodactyls or pterodactyls or whatever you call them. What's going on? Uh oh! I 
I swear that the most times I get attacked. Get out of it. Get out of it. No. Oh, I just escaped that. Oh, that's how you kill one of them. Yeah, I don't really know too much about dinosaurs in terms of their names. I've watched Jurassic Park a few times, but... Yeah, that, that doesn't give me all the knowledge I need to know on all these dinosaurs, so... Alright. You're still with him. Taking care of Tom's wound. Okay, so he's probably going to stay there for a little while. Alright, I think I can just run straight across here. And this door should hopefully be working. Oh, elevator's not responding. Okay. Nothing in there. Oh, okay. This thing's working now. Uh, power for the control panel. Yes. Now, does that open this for me? No. So what exactly did that do? Is there something on... Is there a platform here or something? Get back to Rick and Tom. Okay, so let's get back to Rick and Tom. Thank God, what's her name? Is it Regina? I forgot. Finally, anyway. Have access to the elevator outside. Good. Now we can head straight down to the underground. Ugh, this Tom guy is going to be a... getting in the way. Might just be a cutscene walking to the other side. Yeah. Yeah. Pteranodon, wasn't it? I meant you saw that it was a real dinosaur. <laughs> it's unbelievable. Didn't I tell you? This is just like that movie. <laughs> this is just like that movie. He's, uh, I'm pretty sure he's referring to Jurassic Park. <laughs> Alright, the large size elevator. Don't tell me someone's gonna jump down here. Carrying out room basement one. Hmm. Couple of boxes. Crane. Gina. We have to hurry. Tom's not going to last much longer. I'll clear a path by moving these containers. You just keep an eye on Tom. <laughs> Alright, moving these containers. How am I gonna move them? Does she just do it by power or oh no, sorry, the crane. And I do remember that I've got Emergency hatch can't be opened from this end. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> let's look at the map. My position. Alright. Um, let's have a look around these boxes. Alright. So they're completely blocking off. Blocking me off. I do have a crane key. Oh, I can move this and hopefully get an item. Uh, recovery aid. Nice. What does the recovery aid do again? Oh, I have to mix it with something. Uh, okay, well, I'm probably going to have to mix it with something now anyway. Uh, I can only mix it with my darts, so I might just mix it with these three here. Alright. Okay. Oh, another item. Oh, mini pack. Yeah, I'll take that. Thank you. Plenty of space for them. 
Uh, I wish you had more inventory slots, but I guess that's the uh, the hook of these games. Instruction manual for the crane. Will you read the instructions? Yes, please. How to use the fully automatic control card operated crane. Crane will execute its operations in the order of the control card specified on the program screen. Crane will initiate its operations once all the cards are set and start is selected. selected. During the operation, even if there are errors in the program, those errors will be automatically adjusted by the computer. Thus, there is no possibility of any kind of accident occurring. Well, it's a video game, so an accident is going to occur. Uh, oh, okay. Item. Uh, crane card. Oh, okay. What am I doing here? So, hook, release. Oh, okay. Okay. So, over two, down one. No, I don't want to do that. I want to go... Uh, over one. Hook. Let's give this a go. So over one. No. What's release? No. Okay. Uh. All right. Let's let's just go down one. Hook. All right. Okay, we've done something. <laughs> so let me bring it... Uh, cross two. Up two. And that. And then release. So one, two. One, two. Cross one and release. So I'm guessing this... Alright, so the handle doesn't... No, it does go back to the same spot that it was. Uh, so I've got up to... Alright, let's go up to... Cross one... Down one... And hook. Oop, uh. yeah, and then down one... Yep, nice. Get that one out of the way. Uh, where should I bring it? Uh, I can't go up one. That's the problem. Can I go across two and then just drop? No, I can't. I have to drop it in its own space. Um, right, let's just move you across one. And release. Yeah, this episode is just going to be puzzles. Full puzzles. Alright, let's go up two. And hook. Go this one up here. Drink of water. How do I get this one out of the way? Uh, if I go up, cross one, cross one, okay, cross one, and then across two, then release. Cross one, cross two, release, yep, 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 yep. Now I just need that one in the top right, so uh, up two, I can't go across one, cross two, okay, so cross two, up two, cross one, hook. 
Alright, I think I'm going to get this done pretty quickly. Alright, got that one. Now I just need to drop it off somewhere right there. Um, so I'm going to go across two, up two, across one. Two. Okay, so two, two, one, one, release. Two, up two, cross one, down one. And then I've got a, a clear path for us to go through. Alright, I'm done. Exit. Hopefully that did something. Yep, yeah, did. Concentrate on the mission and leave the rest to me. Right. All right. So I'm doing the mission and he's just saving this if guy. If Gil gives you any more of his bull, be sure to beat him down for me. Okay. Yeah. So I'll beat the uh, the main guy down. Just for him. Just for Rick. Rick yeah. and Tom. What was her name again? Yeah. Regina. Okay. Yeah. Keep forgetting her name. <laughs> okay, someone's gonna jump out at me. No, nothing. This is another key card. Oh, some notes. Someone's decapitated. Dead man has a memo. Today's to do list prepare the DDKs needed to enter the laboratory area. Tomorrow I have to go to the computer room to do maintenance on Dr. Kirk's computer. But I think I left a DDK at the large size elevator control room where I went there yesterday to do the elevator maintenance. I'll have to check it later today. As for the other DDK, I think the rookie guy Tom, who was recently assigned to the laboratory area, has it. I'll have to borrow it from him. I have no idea. Now that jerk approached Kirk, but he seems to have gained his complete trust. It's weird how nobody knows his past history. Well, we know that he was working for us now, so... Ha ha. Alright, some more darts. Single shot. This one. Let me fall asleep. And it, okay, so I've got a whole ton of anesthesia darts, which... It looks like I sort of need to use them, because... I'm running out of space. Now what door can I go into here? Facing south. So it says that I can't go in this one, so I'll just give it a go. Oh, the door has been unlocked. Alright, let me let me go up to this one first. The double door. All the way for carrying in materials. Why not? Rick, watch out! Whoa! Hey, he's fine. Wait, am I in the same room? No, I'm not. Okay, so I think I think I should have went in the other way. Oh, actually, no, no. Both doors lead to the same area. Looking at it. Uh, medi pack. You know, I've got too many items. Ugh. Like, why can't my ammo be in a separate, separate area? All right, I've got one. Ugh. Uh, okay, I'm gonna have to equip, equip a shotgun, and put in one of these. One of these and give it a shot. Ugh, I didn't really want to do that, but you now free up an item spot for another med pack. Uh, let's equip my handgun back again. Yeah, I'll take the med pack. I need as many med packs as I can get. Is there nothing there? Alright, door has been unlocked. Alright. Is this where the other two went? 
No, backup generator room. Oh, okay. I know where I am now. I've already done this, haven't I? Yeah. So I guess that's a bit of a shortcut. I'm just going to go up here just to check exactly where I am. Oh, it's not necessarily a shortcut. It means that I can actually get back to where I need to go. So uh, the first thing I'm going to do right now is go to a save room. Let's see if I can remember how to get there. Oh, and there's that guy there too. Um, so I'll just go around the hallway and then straight. Right, let's get past him without getting damaged. <laughs> uh oh, you're fast one, aren't you? See, at least with Resident Evil, when you're up against zombies, majority of them are, are slow. Now, dinosaurs, like, when are there ever slow dinosaurs? I mean, that aren't really big ones, but... Okay. It'd be good to get a save in. Alright, there we go. I'm about halfway into the episode as well. So I'm hoping at the end of the episode that I can actually save again, because... I think my biggest worry of this full smash is going to be, um, I mean, you, can, you can't sort of just save on the spot in this game. You have to go back to previous rooms, different save rooms, so. Uh. So yeah, in terms of um, saving when I end an episode, I have to be in a spot where I can easily get to one of those save rooms rather than, I don't necessarily like um, pausing the game because that means I have to leave it on all the time um, if I have to do that then I have to do that we'll see we'll see I'll just take it take the game as it comes <clears throat> all right Go down the hallway. Let's see what there is down here. Oop, oh, yep. The only way she's getting really attacked is like just through cutscenes. Ooh. That got him a little bit. Oh, that killed him. <clears throat> Let's see if there's anything else that's going to come around the corner to get me. Or in this room, maybe. Alright, can I hear something? Right, there's nothing around the corner. What does the map want to tell me? Alright, so there's a gate here that I can't get through. There's only one door over here. So this will probably be some sort of control medical room, okay. Uh oh. What do they call them? Compies. Oh, geez, they come through the vents. Alright, I think I've taken care of all of them. Yeah, they just come through the vent. What did I say? Why netting over the ventilation shafts being torn and removed? Yeah. Alright, there's no more around the corner there. Blade is seeping out from hundreds of small cuts. Little compies. Uh, Alright, so... Ooh, okay. So there's a door and some stairs. Let's go into the medic medical room. Which... What's his name might be in? There he is. Uh-oh, so the dinosaur got him. It's not your fault. Yeah. I'll be in the control room.
Come on, man, as if you haven't seen one of your colleagues died before. Alright. Ooh, okay, I've got some more med packs. I'm gonna run out of space from just having med packs. Actually, how many do I have? One, two, three, four. Four med packs. Maybe I can mix some stuff together. What can I mix a dart with? Uh, yeah, yeah, maybe I'll mix the dart with the med pack. Med pack L plus. Yeah, that'll do. Oh. Yeah, I need to have some sort of darts. I wonder if this is like a save room. Oh, ID card. Card data may be written over. Alright. An ID card is a good step in the right direction. Oh, so this this room looks nearly exactly the same as the uh, the other save room, so... Uh, yeah, Tom's corpse. It's here. I don't have any small size keys. I guess I'll find find one of them somewhere. Memo. Alright, let's read his memo. Dr. Sherwood, the ID card on the desk, which I just grabbed, belongs to one of my patients. Please hand it to Colonel Clay when he shows up. He told me that he was going to hold a meeting in the strategy room on the first floor to make preparations for tonight's experiment. Please make sure to hand the card to him. Since one is required to enter the strategy room. Okay, so that card lets me enter the strategy room. Um, wait, so oh, okay, no, there is there is only one door. Is there a memo here? No. Alright, so there's only one door in and out out this room. And it's a save room, so that's super duper. Okay, let's save. Still got just under half an hour left, so time's going very slow for me. So this will lead, lead around to some stairs. Nothing I can get around here. No, no secrets. Okay, control room hall. Nothing in here, is there? I'm gonna jump out and get me. What am I looking for here? Oh, okay. Okay. This, those were the stairs that I couldn't access last time. And there's my box. And I should probably put something in there. I do have quite a few med packs, so... Let's put the... Let's keep a medium and a large plus. And I'll put two large pluses in there. I think that's a good idea. Uh, what else? Is there anything else I need to put in there? Did that sort? No. Wait, what, what the hell am I doing? What the hell am I doing? I want bullets. I'm, I'm pressing the wrong button here. Shotgun bullets. Yeah. And no. Back button. Medium pack large. Okay. I tried hitting the sort button, but that wasn't what I needed to do. Is there anything else I need to put in? Resuscitation? No, I need that. Oh, maybe I should get another one out to have two in my possession. No, they don't combine. Okay. Let me just put that one in there. No. Yes, resuscitation. Dart. Alright. Alright, so let's sort my items. I've got some bullets, shotgun bullets, one res. Oh, maybe I can have two. Let's try that again. Resuscitation, let's put that there. Item. I would say one out of two, one out of two. Can I mix them together? Mix. 
No, I can't. I don't know why it says one out of two. They're the exact same item, but they say one out of two. They're not combining into two. Alright, apologies, but I'm going to get rid of the, that other resuscitation. Alright, now, where did I need to go? Alright, I think it said I needed a, a key card anyway. The ID card. Oh, yeah, Rick's back here. What's he doing? What is he doing? Security control panel and screen shows. What? Okay. There we go. Oh, I don't see any signs in the dock here. That's all you got to tell me? It doesn't even look like you're doing much on the computer. <laughs> Alright, let's put the ID card in. ID card. Uh, item. No, okay, so I can't use the ID card there. Uh, can we have the information on this ID card? Okay, so where else haven't I been? I haven't been over there or there. Alright, let's go up to the save room. the door into the save room was there anything in here probably got everything from in here yeah yeah so if I go out of the save room turn left yeah my destination to the left okay Okie dokie, okie dokie, okie dokie. Let's save you right there. Now, I think there was a dinosaur out here. Would I kill him? Yeah, he's dead. He is dead. And that ID card comes in handy. Nothing in here just yet. Disc, yep. Disc E. And that looks like a Game Boy. A little bit of a Game Boy screen. Ooh, another plug. They're always handy. FC device. When the ID card is an ID this device is used to input the identification data. So I guess I need to find a blank ID card so I can write my own ID clarification on it, clearance on it. Right. Subject, reinforcement of ID management. Earlier in the week, there was a case in which someone used the terminal that rewrites the ID cards to gain unauthorized access. <coughs> Bitch, that was Tom. This person acquired the fingerprint data from the corpse of a staff member who had died in the accident. Forged the death, he, he forged the dead man's ID by using the fingerprint data and entered the laboratory area by way of elevator. Problem is that the fingerprint collecting device can acquire usable fingerprint data even from a corpse. Since we will be having an experiment today, there will be many outsiders visiting this facility. Locating the ID cards for the guests, keep a careful eye on the device. Which is from Scouting Satellite. Not very interesting. What's over here? Ooh, another box. Aha! Is this all my stuff? Okay, so all the... Okay, so all the, all the boxes have different different colours, that's interesting. What if I can bring over my slug bullets and combine them? No, I can't. Hemostat. Um, get my darts. I think I'll just keep what I've got here. 
Okay, so I've seen a green, a blue, or no, a green, a red, and a yellow box. So I think they all link up with each other, maybe. So what do I need to do in here? Track of the soldiers who are positioned in the facility. Did I need to be in here still? I don't see anything flashing. Unless I go back to... Is there any flashing here? To show where I need to go next? Not necessarily. But now that I've got the machine, I might be able to go back to Tom. And get... I've got that fingerprint machine. So let's go back to Tom and see if he can do anything with it, maybe? Who knows? Sorry, not Tom, uh, Rick. Alright. He's in here. So he hopefully he can put some sort of fingerprints on this ID machine. I don't see any signs of docking. No, well, you didn't help me very, very much. Uh, so, what does that item do again? My fingerprint data is currently saved. Do I have to use fingerprint data on a specific person, maybe? Like a dead person? I mean, there is a dead person in the save room, so... And I did get disc E, was it? So I got two disc L's, which I can't remember if I've used yet. Disc E. Oh yeah, there was a dead body in here, so let's see if I can use the machine on it. Where is he? There he is. An item. Okay, so I can use fingerprint data on anyone, but problem is, who's the right person to use it on? It's been a few, a few dead bodies. Hopefully that works. Uh, so is is it a card or it's probably for something else because it's not not technically a card. All right, I guess I'll just go into one of these other rooms. Maybe that was the later uh, that. I don't necessarily know where I need to go. Hmm. Maybe I'll go back down the stairs to where I was previously. Might as well take a look. Very exhilarating stuff here. Very exhilarating. <laughs> so there was something I couldn't access around here. So that's that's the save room. And there were two doors there that I couldn't access, so... Uh... Hmm. Do I need Tom's fingerprints? 
Can I use it again? Okay, so I can use it as many times as I want. Is data stored on the fingerprint device? Override data, yes. So I've got Tom's fingerprints now. But the question is, which door or area... Ooh, excuse me. Which door or area do I actually need the fingerprints for? Because I can't remember. Might as well just go out to those doors that I couldn't access before and see if I can open them with fingerprint data. Yep, I did need to go this way. Regina, what's taking so long? We've got a job to finish. We found Tom. He didn't make it. That idiot. How do things look over on your end? I'm in the lab area. I know the doc's still hiding around here somewhere. I can see an elevator from here. Maybe I can use that to go down from the first floor. Hmm, yeah, maybe we can use the elevator. But I can't get in there. How do I how do I turn that on? Okay, yeah, I can't get through there at all. Hmm. So where does that elevator link up to? So there. There's elevators on either side of the room there. I bet it's one of the this elevator up here. Uh alright, looks like I might be going back up. Um uh, yeah. I don't think I can get through there. I need to go down or up another elevator or whatever. To get there, I think. I just noticed that I've been playing in game for about two hours now, so. I don't think. Uh, map. Yeah, I don't think that, um, <laughs> as I said, I'm going to beat this thing in six hours. I feel like I've done hardly any progress in two hours. You can't open the, uh... You're probably just gonna say the exact same thing, aren't you? What? Oh. I don't see yeah. any signs of Doc here. Oh. I keep forgetting what I need to do, so... I'm gonna try and use the elevator. Well, one of the elevators. Let's go. Ooh. I'm just going to keep saving my progress as much as I can. <laughs> All right, which one am I facing? North. So I need to go east. East and through the back door. No, it's the wrong way. This way is the way I need to go. Oh, it's such a maze, this place. Now, last time it said the elevator was out of order, but... Oh, okay, now it's in order now. Okay, so, researcher's ID card. Can I use... No, I can't use that there. Can't use that there. So, ID card... This sounds like... A researcher's ID card is required. Don't tell me it's right on his body. Possibly a researcher. Oh, okay. Let's grab... Let's grab his fingerprints. I know it said... I know it said ID card. 
but let's just try fingerprint. Um, item. Hmm, how do I get in the elevator? ID card. How dare be overwritten when facility personnel changes occur? Hmm. Can I... Oh, I want to use that with the ID card. An ID card is created. This device is used to input the identification data. So I want to put that on this ID card, don't I? Hmm. Well, where else is blocked off? Because there's nowhere I can get there unless I go down an elevator, I'm assuming. Or is it this, this way? Where is that? Floor two. All right, let's, let's go up a floor. This is probably going to be my last, last hazard in the episode, maybe. See if I can do anything upstairs, because I think I've only been up here once. Um, Alright, so... Uh, just to grab my bearings a bit here. Map. So I go west. Keep going straight to that door, and then turn south. And hopefully there's no dinos in here. Dinos. No. Alright, so I keep going down. Yep, yeah, I am going the right way. Hopefully I can get in here. Yeah. Uh, now I don't need to go in here, I need to go down this way. Yeah, I need to try and avoid fighting as many dinosaurs as possible, I think. Unless I absolutely have to. Door is locked from the other side, ugh. Ugh, 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 ugh. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm stuck. I am stuck. Was that... Maybe I can go into that room the dinosaur was just jumped in front of? I don't know. <clears throat> There's a slot for an antenna activation key. So I don't have any antenna keys. Oh, wait, it said a code in there. Uh, so a strong magnetic storm occur. Prepare for the emergency room. Check the weapon storage locker in the lounge. You can unlock it with the combination 8159. I think I've actually taken a picture of that before. I'm going to double check on my phone. 815. Okay, so, so I have been in here and I have looked at this. So where, okay, so I can't go anything anywhere there, so I think this room is pretty useless. Hmm, 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 hmm. I am stuck. Let's go into the lounge then, I guess. Nothing new in here, is there? Oh, he's coming to get me. 
Get up, get up, get up. Kick him off. Just keep taking him down with bullets. Oh, did I get him? Yeah, he's dead. He's gone. Did I open this? Can't remember if I had any codes for here. Um. What does this say? No. So th there was probably a document which supposedly had a, a code that I could use there. There's no codes in here, is there? No, okay. I'm just going to have a quick look through my phone to see if any of the codes that I'd taken a picture of before work. Let's try this one. O four two six no eight one five nine yes yes okay that did something. Uh, you got the handgun slides. You can remodel your handgun into a Glock thirty five by using this. Okay okay. Nice block. So I'm assuming that means it's more powerful. All right, so that was a that was a little bonus, I guess. A little bonus for me, but it's not really where I need to go. Hmm. Next episode might be a bit of a uh, bit of exploring. I think I might go back to the save room and call it an episode. Yeah, it's just one of those ones where it's like you just run around. And... She needs to get to an elevator. That, that that's all I know of. There was a door. There was a door which I couldn't get past because the power or the security clearance or whatever wasn't activated green sort of like that is it was red and the elevators on the other side which she commented on that she needs to get to so hmm all right i'm